about day. Thank you for joining me again. I was just going to say, don't look at the state of me, but I've put myself on camera, so there you go. <laughs> um, I'm sorting some more jewellery. I promise I will get on to other stuff at some point. But I just want to turn you around and show you why. Don't give up when you've got piles of what looks like. So I'm just sorting through this and spreading it out on the table. Sorry about the rattling, I can't help that. And you like lift it up and, and have a look and think, oh, what's, I don't know, it's all of it. So I've got loads of stuff that's just like elasticated bracelets that people can harvest for beads and things like that. So, uh, you know, like I said before, an elastic spoon and stuff. There's a few necklaces and things in there. Got a couple of bracelets like a charmy type which i'll sell uh, a couple of silver earrings and stuff and then i spotted this so i've detangled it because i saw that little crystal which is absolutely beautiful and then i saw the chain and i thought oh it'd be gold plated no it's hallmarked it's hallmarked on both sides uh, mark 375 uh, it's GA uh, yeah and it's fully hallmarked on the side that side so one of them anyway I've got my spyglass can you see it yeah and it's really long twisted rope focus come on See? Keep going. Keep going. It's really pretty. Now I'm torn. Keep it or sell it? Oh, I don't know because it's really pretty. So, yeah, I'll keep going with this. So I've kept going a bit longer. Look, I'm down to that much. And I've started cutting cords and threads and all sorts of things. I've found this look black as anything. And uh, it's a 925 pendant. <laughs> oh, mother of pearl. Nine to five. Go on, focus. Yeah. Lovely. Oh, pants. Now I've lost it. Oh, and that's what we'll be chucking in there. So that's nice. A silver one and a gold one. So it went a bad buy that. Hello. Moved on a bit now. We're a couple of days late. Uh, one thing, another. Uh, and I'm doing rings today. Last two days I've been listing. Um, bracelets little costume jewelry bracelets and uh, the gold necklace that i showed in the last snippet i've sold that already i got it on sold amazing isn't it um so i thought i'll make a change in my store and i'm doing rings today look at the size of these look at that <laughs> so so far i've been sorting into chunky uh, and then I'll whittle that down into your more sort of modernist uh, things. Look at this. Chumba day. Would look great in that. <laughs> um, so I'll sort it down into sort of pretty decorative. And I'll do some little job loss, I think. I don't know yet. But I did just find this. And it uh, doesn't look like much, really. But... Uh, I'm checking everyone to see if there's any hallmarks. I don't know if you can see in there, but it's got the... Oh, excuse my fingernails. Uh, it's got the 375 uh, anchor. And it says J... Hmm. Hold on. Let me get me... See there a minute. Just that up. It says J... Uh, B. 375 and an anchor, so... Yeah, so that's nice. Uh, I've checked the stone. I've got a gem testing. I've checked the stone. Uh, not a diamond. Uh, it's very, it's very flush fitting in there. Look, it is a pointed back. Uh, so it's a brilliant cut. But I think it's a spinel or something. Uh, 2.85. So that's okay. So I'll put that in my gold and silver lot. I did find this one that says 925 on it. But it's a very strange tarnish, so I'm going to clean it up and test it. So I'll have a fish through, and if I find anything uh, exciting, that's a right knuckle duster, isn't it? Find anything exciting, I'll, I'll come back and show you. So I've done my sorting, 
these are all uh, expandable the thing so it's those I think it's uh, well six four twenty four twenty four on them so don't know whether I'll put them on auction or not. Uh, this is my severed hand that I use when I'm doing my nail videos. <laughs> so I picked a few uh, rings out for her because everybody seems to put rings on when they first craft. So I started it. And I've got a couple already. This one's uh, an 18 karat gold plated, rose gold plated, and it's really nice. I like it. So I could even wear that myself. Uh, so I've got another few rings as well that, that fit her. So that's them, keeping them. Uh, these are all the plastic sort of retro modernist things. These, that one looked quite interesting. I could, I did find a mark on that one and it's actually a signed uh, Sarah Coventry. But that uh, pearl's lost some of its luster. Uh, and this one also, look, I'm showing you him because Lexola says there's always an owl. An owl. So there it is. It ain't going with my chunkies. These are all um, chunky rings of various shapes and sizes. So I'll probably do that into two lots. Uh, I don't know whether this is going to be one or two lots yet. This is uh, all um, glittery, sparkly. Sparkly ones. Quite nice. Some of them. You, you look at and uh, you look at the colour and you just hope it's going to be uh, gold or silver. But no luck with these. Uh, the only other one I've got that's got um, silver is this, which is completely out of shape. So I'll just test it and see if it is marked as 925. I did think it was anyway. So that's going into my scrap. I'll put that there with me, my other silver one. So that's all the rings done. So... So I'm very pleased with how I'm progressing with all this jewellery. Um, I've got, there's like half, half of this box. You know the big chunky ones. I've, so I've cleared a full one, half of this one, and then I've got another one full that's that size that I've got to go through. But um, I think that is a box of bits and bobs that... You know when you start getting to the bottom of the barrel, but you don't want to throw them away because there could be all sorts of earring bags and all sorts of things. So I think that's like residue from before. But down in the bottom of there, I've got a feeling it's an auction lot. So shall we just go and have a look at that? See, that's another one that, that's bound up like that. So I don't know whether that's something I've already part sorted. Uh, I know this is sorted. Uh, bracelets. Bangles. Well, I'm saying sorted. It was like initial sort to go through them all later. So, yeah, more bangles there. I want to take this box and we'll have a look through it. Right. Ooh. I'll get my tripod and we'll have a look what we've got. Right. So this is it as it is. Earrings. They're pretty. They're pretty, aren't they? Oh, I think they're all in pairs. Another ring. A little jelly belly type elephant. It's only little. Put that in my expandable lot. That's nice. And uh, that one comes in the sparklies and then earrings. Put all them together. Wow. Big brooch. I would have worn them on my lapels 
from the 80s. Is that a pair? Oh, it's a pair. Ooh, they go nicely with that, I suppose. Clean them up. So a brooch of massive, chunky brass looking earrings. No, no maker on it. But that's that. What's these? Just oh, oh boxes. Little heart shaped boxes. <laughs> Job lot of mixed or a job lot of brooches. They're a flash, aren't they? Mm. Wow. That's colourful. Mm. I've got to go out to that light for a second. Uh, yeah, no. It's like an atwood and soya type thing, but it's not one of his. There's. Yeah. Somebody might like it as a look like it. Oh, I like that, Poppy. That's lovely. I like that. Nice for Remembrance Sunday. Right, I'm going to bring my chair over and put all these. That's it. Put all them brooches together. Who's that by? P E P. Is that what it says? Copyright P E P. I don't know who they are. That's very striking. Right size that. Oh, great. Napier. That's in good condition as well. Oh, look at Pins, secretary. Pretty. Scarf clip, but that's separate. I'll do a job lot of scarf clips. I've got a, I've got a load somewhere. What's that? Sparkle badge. Oh, for Red Nose Day. I don't know what year it was. Oh, 2017. Got that with pins. Rubbish. A rose. That's just pattern. I was looking for more pins. Plasticky bin. Mm, that feels like old um, cellulose. Yeah, I bet it is. I bet it is that. It's really old plastic. Uh, I think if you warm it, it, it does it smell like 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 a camphor? Um, Cameo style. Broken brooch, got a stone missing. Oh, so how many have I got so far? Two, four, six, eight. About 12 in there. Um, crim, crim, oh, it's Welsh, I'm guessing. Seems I can't pronounce it. Or, I don't know, fir trees. And the D, I know it won't be, but it was that crimmel. Might look that up. Uh, another little pin from National Hospital Service Reserve. Oh, I wonder how old that is. Let's see. H.W. Miller Limited. 
uh, Birmingham or something. Yeah. Oh, that up as well. I like the little interesting things. It gives me a rabbit hole. I can go down for hours. Oh, he's nice. What is a little a skunk or a beaver? No. I don't think he's an otter. He's a bit fat, all the way around for a short tail. Not very, not very good on wildlife, am I? <laughs> Showing myself up. Now, somebody out there might know what that's for. It looks like a little paw print on a ribbon. Uh, Royal British Legion badge. So, good novelty badges. Salzburg, that's Edelweiss, isn't it? Mm, homemade one, some sort. Wow, well, I'm just having myself a nice lucky pin. Crusted stone and no markings. I'll put it in broken because somebody might be able to put new stone in there. Um, that with me little pins mm. on Ooh. nice it's just got one four seven five written on back don't know what that means I'll have to look that up but that's quite a nice one I hope no, not. Uh, yeah, stone missing. Old, very old. I like it when I've got a lot of like gold tone brooches or something that's very similar to do because it's quicker. It's that one. Oh, it's got a breakage. Yeah, I do a broken brooches a lot. Scarf clip, another scarf clip. Oh, there's another lot under there. Broken. I have to keep turning around. Brooch. Yes. What's that? Old oh, bit of chain bin. I like the picture on that. There's a texture to it. Oh, a little embroidered one. So some of these are going like a little job lot rather than doing them separately. Ooh. Snake. Well, if you like snakes. Um, what's that? Oh, cable car. Pretty sad. Cable car. Turn the little rose. Little broken. job lot somebody must have decided they were going to send it off to eBay and they sent it to Oaks instead. I should know what that is. Look at the face. It's weird if it's a dragon isn't it? I'll do Google photo search. So we've got Oberamagal, good. Uh, that's a 
Olympic Games 1960. So, there's good collectors for nearly everything, isn't there? So, the War Widows Association of Great Britain, oh, bless. Harry, Birmingham, is it so? And what's this one? Ambulance Association, the St John's Ambulance. Oh, it's got somebody's name on. Ow! God, I need a bloody setting. It's a bit time I've done this. Uh, I D M A. Looks like bowling dancing. Uh, IDTA. All oh, right. So the different, different awards for dancing. Let me see. Another IDMA. Another one. Treasurer. The. Uh, verse Speaking Juvenile Award. Hmm. Pink Ribbon. Oops. Um, which way up? That way up. So the gymnastics. Yeah, gymnastics of some sort. Uh, what's this? Switzerland. So these are uh, these are an ideal little lot. These pins. They're Rattenberg again. Yeah. Lovely. Oh, let's see what's underneath then. Got them pins set up. Right. That's a pendant. Chunky ring. So rings over there. What's this? I'm pretty sure I've got anything exciting. Goodness me. Bin. Whoa, look at that. Wow. It's got all its stones. Gosh, that's a right big that, isn't it? Let me see it again. Wow. There's a name on it. No. Ooh, that's that's going to be really effective. Somebody. I'll sell that separate. Bangle. Not much prop. A collar necklace. That's going to be quite nice on. Oh my word. That's a heavy piece of jewellery. Me. The chain's not flexible, why not? Oh, it's good. Wow, look at the size of that. Oh, cool. Yeah, at least that's separate. That's quite a statement piece, isn't it? Plasticky chain. Oh, very lightweight. You know, I had a chain like this that was uh, nine carat gold and it was about 30 inches long and I can't bloody find it. Wow. So I'll put that in with my pendants. Oof. This lady liked big jewellery. That's a fair size. 
probably could harvest all these bees. Plasticated bracelets. Charms. Sometimes when you've got charms, they can all be not silver and then there's one that is. So I'll check every one. You know, somebody's bought them one and something. Or they start with a silver and end up getting others on it. It's only elasticated, so they're not going to be on there, but just to make a point. Um, yeah, like a friendship bracelet. Long necklace. Double. I'll put that in the cello where. Ooh. Wow, that catches the light. It's got all the stones. No particular brand, but if you like striking jewelry, that's quite nice. It's a pity it's gone a bit tarnished there, so I might be too broken because. Somebody might be able to utilise this on a different necklace. A uh, little plastic heart and chain that will come in handy for me. Some of my pendants and another little old brooch. Oh, what's this? Ah, oh, told you, an owl <laughs> on a ring. Ah, oh, on a broken ring. And he's quite nice. Surely somebody can use him. He's got his stones as well. Right, I'll put him in broken jewellery, somebody like him. Right, I'm going to leave it there. Hopefully it's about 10 minutes long. So thank you very much for watching, everybody. Love you loads. Thanks so much for sticking with me and coming back. And I will see you soon. Take care. Bye. Mm -hmm.